Trigon Space Story is what you would call an FTL-like. FTL, otherwise known as uh, Faster Than Light, is a game that came out probably early 2010s. Uh, like 20, I would say like 2012, something like that. 2012, 2013, I think it's probably like the golden era of uh, Faster Than Light. It was available on your tablets. You could play it on your PC. Um, it was just uh, just something that everybody was logging, just like just killing time. Uh, and it was a challenging experience. Uh, and it spawned a number of, of games that are trying to capture that same style of like, you know, individual kind of ship management, like room compartment, com uh, compartmentalized like management systems. Um, but nobody really, really nailed it. They all had their cool spin on it, but nothing really captured like that exact kind of essence. And Trigon has also not. <laughs> but they've taken that and they've done, uh, instead of instead of taking the essence of this game and then um, uh, you're adding their own like spin on it, they've taken the essence of the game and then they've built a lot on top of it. Now, <clears throat> this is the game. It's beautiful. It's beautiful, <laughs> right? The the ships look amazing. Uh, the enemy ships when we get there, when you see them, they, they look really cool. Also, uh, the room design and everything. Like this is cool, man. Like this is this is how you think you would remember FTL, uh, but it's not. FTL was like lines. It was like you know, it's like lines on paper. <laughs> and so it was like line art. Yeah, right. Um, so yeah, no, this is like a fully, you know, 2.5D or 3D experience. Uh, so let's go ahead and grab Alexander here. You can move characters around. You can sign them to different areas if you'd like. They move through the doors. The doors uh, actually function. You can take and you can open the doors if you want using this right here. Uh, you can also hotkey that. And there you go. Now we can go and we can actually open all the doors and let all the oxygen out uh, very, very quickly if we wanted to. <laughs> so you see that everything turns red. So understand that uh, all of the doors can be controlled individually or as a whole that is essentially just your door system each there's other systems as well they don't all have to be ma micromanaged or anything but you will come across other systems that will have uh, micromanaged capabilities and things that you can do here's your individual ships uh, or your, your weapons we'll talk about that when we get into a fight bottom left corner and this is where your power and everything is this is your available power and these are where you're where it's all assigned you notice i have nothing in the med bay that means the med bay does not function what i have to do is probably take some power out of weapons i'll right click on that and then i can click on it there you see how i went to the pool here and i said hey i got one power left let's go and throw the med bay med base activated the lights turns on you could run alexander in there and get that one health i took from him because he's running oxygen nope okay he held his breath good job now when somebody is working somewhere you can see this little chevron that appears right right below there that just means that there's an extra perk because controlled by the operator so minus 25 percent shield recharge time slash plus 50 percent shield regeneration speed so it gets a perk because somebody's standing there and over here with this one it says controlled by the operator and the hyper op hyperdrive operator is operating it uh is that what hina is let me see hina is uh, a hyperdrive operator perfect so th they specialize in this it's going to get an extra boost which is what let me see uh plus zero percent evasion oh that's nice um but has 50% hyperdrive charge speed. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. And this is Gene. Gene is the uh, is the uh, the captain. Um, not just of uh, of the ship, but also like of the run. If he dies, or then that's it. <laughs> then the, the game is over. So Gene must be protected at all costs. I'm not a big fan of that that element of this. But you know, it is what it is. <laughs> so uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the map here. The map is fully like zoomable, zoom outable, whatever. You kind of manipulate it, kind of like No Man's Sky style. Very cool. Uh, let's go ahead and zoom back out. It's a pretty big map. Essentially giving you kind of like an open nodal experience, right? I don't want to say open world because you're you're just transferring from like encounter to encounter to encounter. Um but e but each one of these, you know, sectors just has a ton of different experiences within them, right? And then you could kind of path your own way uh through them. So it gives you a very a very uh, um open world type experience in that regard. So, let's see. Uh this one has a trait here, nebula. Uh this one has uh, also a nebula. This says that there's uh an encounter there of some sort. Oh, never mind. That's the sector exit. So that means there's a big boss man standing right there um uh, blocking that. So let's go ahead and go to nebula so you can see what that looks like. And then we'll uh wait, are we are we are we good? Let me see. Let's take the power out of that, put it in here. And then what's up? Are we going to we... Oh, we can't go to the Yeah, we can. There we go. Nice flashy, flashy jump. 
music's nice and intense. Honestly, you accidentally happen upon some pirates carving up their loot stolen from local colonies and stations. They are quarreling about how to divvy up their bounty. And ask you as an experienced, uh, and ask you as an experienced venator to decide how it should be divided up. Be careful how you choose. I thought the venators were like the bad guys. Uh, divide the loot equally. The captains get more. The crews get less. Ah, divide it equally. There we go. Uh, you suggest the best possible solution. The pirates arguing and bickering died down, and you easily divide the bounty between everyone. You get a small part for your help as well. All right. Cool. Hey, 520 credits and some scrap. Cool. So, let's not talk about that because we got to get into a fight. Oh, I could talk about the mechanics. It takes... Oh, God. Let's just get into a damn fight. Let me see. Let's go. Let's go right to the gate boss. Let's go. Gate boss time. Wasting zero time. There's the gate. Looks pretty cool over in the corner. Upon arriving in the system, you see a rocky ship. It seems to be guarding the gates to the sector. <gasps> okay, let's do it. Here it is. Such a cool looking ship. Like a flying purple nutsack. All right, so the game pauses. Now, pausing is a primary mechanic in this game. Like, this is something you're going to use all the time. <laughs> So get used to me using all the time. Uh, there is an Iron Man mode that does not have pausing if you want uh, if you want that kind of experience. It is extraordinarily hectic, uh, and the game already has like weird kind of balancing uh, not sort of issues, but like sometimes you'll just run into something and it'll just completely wreck you, and then other times you go through and clear entire sectors. So, well, let's just get into a fight here. I have rockets and I have plasma weapons. Energy weapons will not penetrate shields. They'll attack, they'll hit the shields. And this guy has 20 shields. So this and this will do how much damage? Let me see. Uh, hold damage, shield damage 10. Okay, cool. It does two blasts in one, I think. Yeah, two shots. So this is gonna take down a shield like immediately, which is cool. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and actually activate uh, the auto fire mode there. And then let me see. Um, I get to choose which system that I want to target. Looking at here, that my my sensors allow me to see that this that this ship's layout. Uh, is composed of these individual modules and so I can see that they have um, the armory module the weapon system is only only two so I'll probably just target that Do they have a teleporter or anything Pro oh they have a teleporter already oh my god I'm already counting teleporters holy crap all right so no uh, change of plan we're gonna actually fire everything at the teleporters to keep them from teleporting and boarding my ship that's that's the worst possible thing that could happen right now we just started damn it <laughs> Oh my god, and a miss. There's gonna be lots of misses. You have to get used to that. Am I firing anything here? What's going on with this guy? Is that not gonna go? I think I deactivated something there. Okay, here they are. They're here. Oh boy. Okay, let's grab. Um, or I took damage here. Let's go and grab this person, put him there. They can repair that. Then we're gonna go ahead and grab. Fucking. Oh, I, mean, I got only just two more people. Get him there. Take them out. He's gonna fix O2, just to make sure that we don't lose any of that. Oh good, we can double team these guys, this guy here. Yeah, we're hurting. We still have weapons auto-firing, right? Yeah, we do. Okay, good, and they're hitting the, that. They're not gonna be teleported back, so let's go ahead and take out the weapon system next. Let's go ahead and change gears. You there, you there. So everything's going towards the weapon system, and then all these guys are gonna, who brought the freaks? Yeah. These guys are gonna duke it out, basically. Okay, did somebody just uh, teleport again? Yes, they did, okay. Now these guys, um, even though they have air, um, or sorry, uh, oxygen uh, generators on the ship, uh, I found that they don't need air to breathe. So I'm not going to, f I'm, I, I can't, I have the option to open up all the doors here and uh, try to suffocate them. But, oh, the hyena is done. Hyena, really? Oh my god. Uh, the hyena, get over here. Okay, this guy's gonna die, let's go and get him out of there real quick. Get him in the back. Okay, now Jean, oh my gosh, she just took a hit. No, 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 don't worry about that. Okay, let's get in here. I didn't I say I just I just two seconds ago something about balance, didn't I? Okay, you gotta fix that, fix that or something. Let them have the damn doors. Okay. Their weapons are not offline yet. I have seven of those. Let's switch to burst fire mode. I don't know what it does, but we're gonna do it. <laughs> Make sure you stay on track there. Am I out of rockets or something? Why are you not firing? Two, 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 two. Oh, no power? What? Oh my god, I lost power. What? Nope. Oh, because it's damaged. Oh shit. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let me see. Power there. Get them done. You get up there. You guys don't need that shit. He needs that. God, that was brutal. That was damaged. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm starting to lose track of everything that's going on. It's just chaos right now, as you can see. Okay, their weapon system is completely offline. Great. Next, we target their um, 
their cockpit, and that will take out their uh, maneuvering, so they will not have any any dodge. We're taking every single hit right now because we're not we're not dodging anything because our cockpit is damaged. So we're gonna return the favor here. Power back, good. Get it back. Okay. Yeah, that's what I want. There it goes. Target like anything. Target the room. The teleporter is still online. It is. Let's target that next. Let's target the shield, actually. Yeah. While well, they're now now they're running around frantically. Their shields are done. They're done. Wow! I cannot believe we survived this. Unbelievable. No more rockets. Just just shoot. No more rockets. No more rockets. Stop it. Stop with the rockets. Excellent. This is great. Man, they're just done. Come on. Don't be shy. Whoa, that was intense. That was intense. Yeah. This is this is the I mean the music helps too, but like, man, like this is great. Um, but as you can see, like that's that was hard. Like there, I messed up a bunch of times there because I just lost track of everything that's going on. But that was that was hard. So this is the, the these this is the, uh, the one of the main complaints that some people have about the game is that it's um, it's not just difficult, but damn, I should be repairing this if I'm talking. Um, uh, but it's just uh, inconsistent. We did go right to the gate boss, I guess, but still. <laughs> I suppose I might have something to do with it. Maybe it was a bad example. Hyena, come over here, please. Alexander, you are the... You're that guy. Go over there. What are your specialty, Hyena? Let me see. Hyena is a hyperdrive operator. Oh, whoops. My bad. Well, Alexander, what do you do? Oh, you're an engineer. Just a regular engineer. Get your ass over somewhere else. Go over there. Hyena. And over here. Okay. So, over here, we have uh, some chevrons here pointing. Um, saying that we have a level up available. Uh, these are all pretty much the same. Um, let me see. Hulk, or... Oh, well, pretty much the same early on in the first like, couple levels. There's only like maybe four different ones you could select from. Uh, let's see, assault body armor and coming damage reduced by 25. I just give them more health. I just feel like that's just, it just, I mean, I, I love effective health. As a, as a tank person, I love effective health, but uh, I just feel like the making them hulkier just really works out better. <laughs> see, a sprinter uh, or unit health increased by 50. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just stacking Stam right now is what I'm doing. Help, yeah, let's do it. Let's make them all super strong. Excellent. Oh, man. So, yeah, we're getting into hyperdrive now. Uh, let's go take the power out of there. Put it back on the shields. Uh, everything is repaired. Uh, we have a little bit of health uh, issues in some places, but mostly fine. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at management here. Um, we're, we could go to the next sector, but we wouldn't really gain anything from doing that. You just go through a teleporter, and all that's going to happen is I'm going to run into some actual real hard guys, and that's going to be the end. I want to show you guys more of the game. <laughs> so we're going to go to uh, uh, another couple nodes, nearby nodes. Uh, but first, take a look at management here. We can spend scrap that we've collected, which we have 212, in order to do repairs on the ship. So we can spend all the scrap, and that would be... Uh, how much scrap would that be? Uh, minus 80 scrap. So that's... There's probably some value there, but nah. <laughs> I'll just I'll just re regret it later. Uh, you can also increase your power uh, um, uh, limitations and your razor power limitations and uh, increase the amount of power available to you to divvy up amongst your power systems. These subsystems do not require any of these power units, so you could just, uh, if you want to upgrade, you just upgrade them and that's it. Uh, this one's kind of nice. It's it's you know added a two it's, as an autopilot system, so that way whenever my I only have three three people, so whenever one of them gets away from the ship, uh, from the cockpit, uh, it still flies itself a little bit. Uh, I also there, I have one more upgrade. I could get uh, plus ten percent evasion with the system. Now nah, just the system's fine. Uh, this will show me where stations are on the map. Now, for the purpose of this video, I'm going to get this because I want to show you guys a station. Uh, we go on trade and everything. It's kind of an integral part of the game. Uh, and then we can strengthen the doors if we want. That's already 100 of my, of my scrap. I'm probably going to go and hold on to that. I don't really have anything, any power that I need to spend anywhere else, I don't think. Uh-oh. Uh so, a ventilator ship has showed up. The actual bad guys. This is a drone. This is a drone without a cloaking system. So, this should be pretty quick, actually. Let's go ahead and just target his... Oh, wait, is he going to give it to me? Okay. We'll just target his weapon system. Just basically take it offline, like, instantly. Awesome. Won't make, make any more... Any more rockets. Keep going, though, dude. One can go. You know, talking that off. 
Yeah, those drones are pretty easy. One more shot and they're done for! Yes, they are. Let me see. Hey, that's an easy way to farm some scrap. We can just hang out. So what happened was we wasted too much time sitting here idling. And we, we went forward to game day and we were discovered. But I'm not done. Am I done? We have crew. Okay, we already saw crew to stuff. And this is a carbo hold. Oh, oh, what is this? Oh, man. When did we pick this up? Uh, Retribution rocket launcher. Phenomenal. Bro. Yeah, we're going to swap out for this. How much power does it need? Two shots right. And one? One? Ten shots, two. Is there any info on this? It doesn't tell me anything. It just is phenomenal. I'm not entirely trusting of that. I'm going to go ahead and put that back on. I have how many rockets? I have one rocket? Do I really have one rocket? I have four rockets. Okay. Uh, and oh, supplies. They're not just burgers. Oh, some of you guys are probably like, what the hell? No, they're not just burgers. They're supplies. They use a burger for some reason. Um, <laughs> let's see. Let's go to... Okay, there's a mission there. And, oh, cool. Look at that. See? See, see, see? Let's go ahead and bounce to this. It was right there. Did I not see it the first time? Damn. You could see the nearby nodes. So across the wreckage of a huge slaver ship. Ooh, okay. Okay, better leave it while you still can. Okay, let's leave it while I still can. So asteroids. At, we gotta leave right now. Um, asteroids will do damage to your ship at random. Even while I'm sitting there in the menu, it'll come and do damage. The time continues. Even when you're in menus, time keeps going. <laughs> As you fly through the system, you come across a trading station. Yes. Station. So here we go. The shiny things. This is what you click on. Uh, we got trade, we got shipyard, we got bar. You click on any one of them and go through tabs if you want to just use the UI. I could go. I can actually uh, pick up a couple of new people. Freddy the Warrior uh, with 100 health, maximum health, close combat, 3 plus 2, uh, 4 plus 1 range combat. I mean, that's pretty good stuff. I mean, look at my dudes. Let me see. 3 and 3, and he's got 3 plus 2. Yeah. Huh. Cool. A sharpened claws and bloodsucker. Those are interesting traits. And then just all the medics, uh, marinas of pilots. So we can hire another person if we want. We can also go to trade. We could trade for some stuff. Maybe we'll pick up some more. Let me see. We got 12 fuel. Um, let me see. This is such a weird thing. They don't tell you anything about it. We, we Hopefully we just blast through the rest of this game. Let me see. Defensive drone. I don't have a drone system. Let's grab some more rockets. Only five? Sure. I'll take all five of them, I guess. Oh, shockwave EMP. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I forgot you could load different rockets into our uh, into our system here. Oh, mining cutter. Ooh, that's really good. Oh, it's a thousand. Oh man, I can't afford that. Okay, thermal bomb. Let's see shockwave EMP rockets. Let's go and grab some of these. Thirteen thirty-one sixty-nine. Nice. This is grab ten though. Got to be a little frugal. There you go. And then the massive rockets. Hull damage 15, crew damage 15, so done 15. What's the difference to that in this one? 10, 10, 10. Oh, they're just better, I guess. So, <laughs> yeah, we'll just buy all of them. Cool. We have an assortment of missiles to go through on our ret phenomenal retribution rocket launcher. Then we go to shipyard. We can buy modules. I just, I, like I discussed earlier, each room is an individual module. Um, cryo chamber, drone control module. Uh, that'd be kind of cool. I have not done that yet. Let's try that. Let's, do, let's get a drone control module. And then we'll go trade. Now, listen, real quick. I could go teleporter and then flip back and buy a couple people or rent or whatever. I could pay, you know, hire a bunch of people. God, whatever the word is for people. <laughs> uh, we could hire a bunch of people and just become a boarding crew party. And that's it. Like, I'll hire like one, two. Okay, I can afford both. I could probably sell a couple things, actually. And I would, yeah, if I sold that, then I could, yeah, if I sold that, then I could pick up her her and her and then I would have a boarding crew party they don't have to be necessarily warriors right um and then I, that would change completely how I would play 100% now, what is this a cargo hold I don't need that let me see it's the drone control module so let's go and they have a drone in here right let's go and grab a drone while we're here defensive drone uh to a positive chasm yeah okay it's defensive drone let's grab it and just one oh just one hmm okay so 14, so 48. Go back to the shipyard. Let me see. Drones. We knew our power. Let's go and grab. God, 630. Oh, the scrap would probably be cheaper, huh? Hmm. That's really expensive. Yeah. We'll spend scrap. I'm not going to bother with that. How much is this? Oh, that's not too bad. 240? I'll take that. Okay. Let's see, 280 for energy. So we'll upgrade that. What do we get for two energy slots? Oh, just uh, two drones. Gotcha. Gosh, should we get like another module? We're, we actually are kind of loaded. Let's get a stealth module. Let's 
except, and then we're not going to buy any power. We'll use our scrap to... Yeah, see, 90 scrap. Oh, okay, hmm. Well, I can't afford to get two of them. Just one. So let's go back to the station real quick, and I will I will pay for that one more. Let me see. Shipyard. More power. Dude, man. God! Oh! Hey. Okay, we need it, though. We need that power. So now let's take a look at our ship systems. Now we have... Uh, whoa, big one. Drone control module. So let's grab... Yeah, grab some power in there. Oh, I gotta put a, a drone in there, it looks like. So management. See, cargo holds. Weapons, probably drones there. We'll drop that in there. Oh man, you guys are getting the full show here. This is great. Not launched. All right, yes. Put that there. Let me see power. Ah, uh, more power to this would be good, but uh, we have enough to keep that thing powered there. Now we have to choose the rocket, right? This is where we choose speedfire rockets, massive rockets. Go speedfire rockets. There we go. And we can load a different rocket in this one if we wanted to. I'm genuinely curious what that's gonna do. Uh, and then we could pop one power into stealth. So this is this is actually perfect. Nice. One power, one power into stealth. Uh, yeah, we're pretty well balanced here. I think we're ready to go. Let's do it. Let's go to uh, let's go do this mission over here, which requires to go to what? This tooltip is very annoyingly placed. Let's like go here and get into a fight with whatever this is. Let's do it. I'm 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 itching. I'm itching for a fight right now. Let's go. Oh, this is not it. Oh, one of the Atari ambassadors hails you. He asks to deliver an important message to the ambassador in the next sector. Judging from his expression, he's holding something back. Yeah, sure. Okay, we've got a new mission. Oh, maybe not. Actually, it's not a mission. Wait, you agreed to forward the report over conscious suddenly. Oh, virus infiltrates your system. Oh, you've been tricked and your ship is being used as a transmitter. Bloody Atari. Mm-hmm. Mm. Okay, yeah, and, and also a drone. And also a drone. This one has, this one has a um a cloak so i'm not gonna waste the missile because it's going to disappear i'm gonna fire on it though just to provoke it a little bit let me see i don't think we need defense to reload in time shots fires around and just let's launch it right empty what does that mean is the charge first it's got a power oh it needs one more power for the mm, i see okay s for stealth if I take a power from there, then I can put one power in there. Is that it? Charges automated drones. Okay. Oh, maybe it's charging it right now. Okay. Okay. My first time using it in this game. Uh, it did not stealth, did it? Is it not going to stealth? It's taunting me is what it's doing. I'm firing a missile. It's going to stealth. Whoa! Wow, that was huge damage. Okay. That's not going anywhere now, so we'll just keep on pelting it. Uh, we're, we're also taking some damage. Come on. Come on. There it is. There it is. Oh, man. I don't know how that happened, but who cares? <laughs> who cares? We won. Oh, did that thing ever charge? <laughs> I'll be a blaster turret. Wait, a turret? Oh, it's right. Yeah, class weapon. Excellent. Yeah, what's up with this? Activate select. Oh, that's wait. Oh, five. Yeah, okay. Yeah, but I don't understand. Hmm. This empty. Oh, I know. I, I know what it is. Uh, there's a special kind of currency you have to pick up. Not currency, but like a consumable, like drone parts or something like that. Dang. Oh man, you guys are not getting the whole show. Uh, how much fuel do I have? Let me see. I have. 14 fuel. I can make plenty of jumps. You know what? We're going to go back. We're going to go back and see if they sell it. Wait a minute. How broke am I? I just got some money, right? Right? Yeah, I think so. 381. Yeah, that's enough. Station. Trade. These guys right here. Drone replicants. 300. Perfect. Okay, I don't need that many. <laughs> yeah, I got like 10. There you go. Except, did you take my money? It did. Good. All right, now we're in business. <laughs> that's all I need. I thought something was up. I just happened to see that on a previous run too. Okay, here we go. Venator ship. Let's go launch this. Uh, uh, well, we're gonna stealth first, I guess, and then we're gonna pull this out. Oh, they don't have stealth. Okay, well, this is gonna be just like easy. What's their shield look like, man? Did I, pull my, did I pull me out of stealth that way? 
Not launched. Is it because nobody's manning it? No. Let me see. Not launched. I mean, like, it would be cool. I guess I have to have somebody manning the, the, um... The module. Let's see. Oh, yeah, I have to have someone manning the module. Oh, man, I thought it was automated drones. Man, this is the future. Come on, now. This is the future. Are we done with this thing? God, hurry up. Oh, fire. Check this out. Uh, let's go and open the door. There you go. The fire is taken care of. Oh, there's fire in there, too. Mm hmm Okay, Heine. What are you doing, Heine? What is Heine doing? Oh, you're putting the fire out? Why are you putting the fire out? I didn't, did I tell you to do that? Get out of there. Okay, okay. Let's, let's just... Calm, everyone calm down for a second. <laughs> we have a defensive drone out there healing us up. Uh, let's... See, I don't want my people to get in here and try to try to take care of this problem. So I'm gonna open some doors, and we'll keep everybody over here for now, just so we can vent out this uh, this fire. Very cool, though. Did it do anything? <laughs> Did it do anything at all? Let me see. Shots around. See, reloading time. Okay. Okay, fire's out. Good. Just gonna close all the doors. Uh, simultaneously open all the doors. Get all that. There we go. Going here. Uh huh. Okay, and then you go back. Where were you, Alexander? You're all the way in the back. Oh, you're an engineer. Let's go fix this. Oh man, sometimes encounters can be just so taxing. <laughs> now, um, I I I neglected to buy food. <laughs> Son of a bitch, man! Neglected to buy freaking food. <sighs> all right, Hina, you're fine. <laughs> You're fine. You'll be fine. Back to the shields. Let's go to this thing. Hopefully they have food. Oh. What's up? I can make that jump. Yeah, you can. How long is this episode going to be? I <laughs> Think about it now. Oh, here we go. Perfect. So, sometimes you have story elements that will, um, uh, that have benefits depending on what classes you have available on your ship. If you don't have the coolest classes, then these options will just not be available. So send one crew members to examine the place. It could have a negative outcome. But these ones uh, send a drone or engineers and experts engineer examine the place. Uh, what is send a drone? So you send one of your drones to test the waters. The sensors show that the station was the site of a battlefield. Strange symbols in the form of triangles scare you. Uh, the drone finds an intact uh, Tarticon and brings it on board. So this is asteroid turn out. Okay, this is this is an extra NPC basically. You're gonna get this quest a lot, and this is uh, this is definitely a, a, a negative here, is that you get a lot of repeatable uh, uh, repeating quests, a lot of repeating quests, and so when you play, you know, in a game like this, you're you're like playing through a sector for 30 minutes, and then you die, and then you go back. You get pretty tired of those same quests. Now this is a good mission because it's gonna give us. Uh, uh, a new crew member, so we want this, and the crew member could potentially have a perk that could benefit us as well. So let me see. It looks like we go around this way. We get into some uh, into some shenanigans. Go to Tabit, right? Oh, here we go. I guess we go Cursa. One, two. We don't have food though, man. We have to make our way back to the, st the store. Let me see. Let's go over here. If we get into a fight, that's what I want. If we get into a fight, then mm, bounty's gonna increase if I go there. Then hopefully we'll get food, you know. Otherwise, my dudes will starve. And that's bad. Okay, enjoy the show. Oh, okay, this is uh, this is basically just a pick pick what you want to upgrade on your ship. So, do you want to upgrade your sh your uh, um, your your cockpit, uh, your, your 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 jump? I think this is your hyperdrive, uh, your shields or your weapons. And I think I'm going to upgrade my this upgrade my cockpit because that'll give me the yeah three so now that's maxed out I think that see pilot controlled operate evasion so pilot uh give me plus 12 evasion my total evasion is 31 percent yeah so if I step away I sell 26 percent technically I don't have to have anybody up there at all he just stays up there just give me the five percent so if he has if he can go somewhere else oh hold on a second he has an upgrade here natural born ace hull damage is had from the units the operator's position at the bridge oh well shit i guess he has to stay there evasion increases by 0.2 percent for every one percent hp the ship loses the unit must be in the operator's position at the bridge oh man oh again this comes down to effective health versus just like flat out like you know health oh man 
Let me see. Steady hand, let's do that. Okay. Let's go see if we can buy some burgers. Okay, uh, are we losing health? Oh, we are. We took power out of there or something. <laughs> I was like, are we losing? Are we losing oxygen? She's. Oh no! God. <laughs> I just hit the wrong stupid button. Uh, okay. Okay, store. At the store now. Station. Let's see. Bar. No, no, no bar. Trade. Burgers. Cheese. Give me all the burger. Cheese burgers. Oh, we have more stuff actually. Ooh, a combat drone. Yeah. How much is that? Oh man. What kind of money. Why is this so expensive? Let's see, we can buy some scrap for seven. I mean, I feel like that pays for itself, right? <laughs> okay, good. Oh wait, I have a weapon to sell. If you trade the blaster turret, yeah, I definitely don't need that. 350, huh? Hmm. You know what? I'll take the blaster turret over this a uh, second rocket launcher. Let's get rid of that. There we go. How much power does this thing want? Two power. Okay. We'll trade that. And then it gives a 382 shipyard. Can we afford to upgrade our... Damn, really, we should take the power upgrade. Nope, I cannot. All right, well, that's going to be our next upgrade then. Oh, wait, are we still not getting power here, guys? Or uh, health? Oxygen? Jesus Christ. Let's see. Let's make our way over there. Do we already do an unknown system? Nope. Mm, oh, let's see. Oh, you enter a system full of other ships. You look around, you quickly realize it's a casino fun! Casino station! Alright! So, minus 300 credits, have some fun. Uh, get drunk with the Venators. Fly away before you waste all your money. Let's fly away because you send away for the hyperdrive to charge and leave. Yep. Uh, wait, let's see. Oh, you could end up. You decide to fly away for. Yeah, okay. Yeah, um. There are things you could do there, but. The last time I talked to some. I talked to the Venators, I think. And they were like, oh man, you you guys are pretty cool, so we won't attack you for a little while. When I came out, I immediately got attacked. So I didn't want to replicate that. Fire station there, usually disguised as being uninhabited. uninhabited. See, the station is in chaos, gambling, forbidden pleasures, illegal goods, somewhere in the mess. Must be the Tarticon hacker you were looking for. All right. So let's buy a lottery ticket, because that was one of the clues in the previous text. But since I've done this quest now, like six times, um... Yeah, we got just a little Tartacron. There you go. Hand over the weapons. Engineer, check the price for your engineer. Again, I've already done this a million times. But, but what a name. Cool. Bam. So now we have in our possession a drone. Does this drone have... Oh, it has a accuracy. Ooh, increases. Accuracy increases to 100% for 10 seconds. Let's put him in the weapon position. Awesome. People are starving. Did I just buy a bunch of burgers? <gasps> what happened to the burgers? <laughs> Did I not buy? Oh, my God. Let's go to... Hey, you know what? We had to end this shit anyways. <laughs> I'm not making an hour video for this. I gotta record another one. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, provide help. Let's provide some help. See what happens. You determine the coordinates of the signal source and charge the hyperdrive. Oh, SOS signal. Okay. Venator enters the ship. Man, they're not getting any food. It's a fucking drone. Damn it. Damn it. Ugh. Just blast the damn... God. This is juicy. I love that. And it's just an I win button, that thing. Let me see. I've got a bunch of stuff. Didn't get any burgers, though, did we? No. Starving. Hyperdrive expert when entering combat. See if hyperdrive is fully charged. That's the point of energy. The units will be hyperdrive operator position. Dang. Oh, this is such a hard one. Because you can just jump. We can just jump right away. Let's do it. Let's just jump right away. Assuming they don't die of starvation. Ooh. Two levels to the occupied system or two points of energy to the system in their module. Wait, what? Two points of energy to the system in their module. Or two levels to the occupied system. Oh, two levels. Oh, man. Hold on. Where? Wait, Where? where's an engineer? Anywhere. Let's do two levels. Oh, we got shields. Oh, yeah. Oh man. Okay, now I really want to make this work. I really want I keep on hitting escape, sorry. I really want to make this work. Um wonder if I can make it back 
without dying. Let's go before we, a day passes. You probably right, says you un unman. Oh god, another unmanned ship. Is my gonna come online? It is. See, that's why you do that right there. That's exactly why you do that. Counter the enemy's been lost. Hyperdrive is charging. Yeah, that's right. Get out of here. Okay. Oh, oh god. Oh no. Oh no. Two of them died. <laughs> I starved. I fucking starved. Oh, right into one of these, huh? Damn it. Oh man. Just finish it, please. Did I miss? Did I miss? What happened? Put me out of my misery. Unbelievable. Starving. Just starved. Hey, I got the drone, though. We're still gonna starve, though, right? Is my last guy gonna make it? Captain's gotta make it, man. Captain's good. Let's go back. What did I do wrong? Oh, man. Trade, let me see, burgers, man, I swear I threw them down here and said yes. Oh, I didn't hit accept, did I? That's what it was, and it didn't go there. Right, is that it? It sure is. Sure is. Well, let's, let's see how much money do I have, 486? Can I buy somebody, someone cheap? Can I hire a person to do a job for me? Jesus, man, it's the most expensive people. Hey, let's keep going. We got this, we don't need those people anyways. Besides, we got a, we got a, we got a, a quest right here next to us. We're just gonna own this entire sector, just me and my drone buddy. Human ship got stuck in the system. The captain hails you and requests your assistance. Our ship's AI has gone mad. Let's see, send a target on to deal with the problem. Okay. His name is Pal. He's nice to talk to. Release the captain. Decide to travel off in search of adventure. Human is ours now. Why don't we eat him? This guy. Hey, would you look at that? We got a warrior named Butcher. No, Freddy. And he's a butcher. And he's a warrior also. And he has a three plus two. I think this was fate. I think this was fate right here. Oh, Freddy, uh, warrior buddy. Let's get you to, um, shields. Oh, that's a shame. I lost that fucking shield guy. What a shame. Uh, these are just automated drone. We're gonna, whoa, look at that hyperdrive. What the hell? Is it even gonna stick around any, for more than two seconds? I'm just gonna blast that. Okay, and then, I guess we'll just stealth, actually. Yeah, I, I couldn't remember the key for it. Nice. Unlock Blast Turret Mark II. Ooh. What? Same Blast Plus. Okay, so I must have unlocked it somewhere. Where, where though? The adventure continues, guys. We're still going. We're going to keep going. Let's see. Cargo hold. I didn't get it. So I unlocked it, huh? Hmm. Just means that I get to I get to have it in the future. All right, Freddy, so listen. Um, enemy units are stunned, effective in the module the units located. Dang, accuracy increased 100%. Yeah, wow. Well, uh, let's see. We already own... I guess we go this way to Fomosamaka. Let me see. Can I make my way all the way to the gate? I sure can. Wow, that's a huge jump. I have seven jumps left. Gotta keep an eye on that. We're gonna jump on a teleporter before damn unmanned stupid ship shows up. What are you? What do you got? Mm-hmm. Some weapons. Lots of big weapons actually. Twenty-three hull. Only so many rockets though. Oh, the stealth. Oh, the stealth was canceled again by the um, by my weapons shooting. Although it seems that my shields can handle the the fire, the gunfire here. The barrage, I think. Yeah. We have really good evasion, so... That plus the shields, we could just not waste any rockets there. Maybe get lucky picks them up? Nope. Nope! How much stat? Oh, okay, not, not, not enough to really do too much. Actually, that's, that's a lot of... Uh, let's go to the next sector here. Oh, shit! Wait, is that gonna take me there? Oh, it is? Okay. <laughs> I used to... I, I usually click on the actual teleporter, the warp thing, warp gate. Like, right here, right here, because you can click on that, too. Kind of cool. See, event patrol. Yeah, see, like that. Click and go. Um, let's see, management. Let's see, go to crew. No, a ship. And let's put some more points into... The shields, man. I feel like maybe the shields should be what we put some points into, right? What is that, 60? Let's put one here. Let's put one here. Don't worry about the doors. Stealth is C. 15 second reload, 20 second reload. Okay. <clears throat> let's see. Oxygen. Gosh, yeah, that's kind of handy. The speed, recovery speed. Oh, man. 
How much is that? 220. And then I think it's probably good. Um, oh, whoops. I forgot we have to actually pay for the... Uh, let's see. For the power, too. So, never mind. Cut back a little bit. A day passed. Yeah, we gotta be careful with that because that's how you get discovered. So power there, put power into... Okay, we can't afford that one yet. That'll be the next thing we go to. Let's go to this store. Nothing here? Okay. Accept the signal. You accept the challenge. The vendor tells you about a small cargo that they want to smuggle near you. Okay, so smuggling interception. Another mission. Another mission I've already done! <laughs> There's just not a lot of mission variety, you know? I don't want to complain too much, but there's, there's not. Let me see how much money do we have. 806. How much fuel? Okay. We're going to do a side hop here. The double-double. The double-double. <laughs> Burgers. I mean, come on. It's a trend. Upon arrival, suspicious solitary hand-cut asteroid. Ooh. Ooh, a pirate ship. That means there's people on it. Is there tell oh, there's... Okay, there is people on it. Um, do they not have oxygen in there for some reason? Let me see weapons. Let's see shield command. Let's see the pilot. Okay, let's blast this with these to so the autopilot or auto automatic fire. Okay, let's not miss too much, guys. Let's not miss too much. Let's uh activate our special. A specialty here. Give us some wins. I have a feeling they're about to flee. No, that's why I'm going for this. Now they flee, my bounty goes up, which means I'm gonna, I'm gonna, yeah, get higher level enemies messing with me. So that's why I want to keep this guy in check here if I can, without necessarily wasting a rocket. I think it'd be 103 seconds. Dang, son, a long time. Okay, I'm not winning that fight. Let's go put this back on. We will blast them once with this and hope we get lucky. Okay. <laughs> Beautiful. Grab everything before you leave the system. Ooh, there's a lot of stuff on it. Some drone parts too. Minus 0.3. Excellent. Let me see. So that goes down while we're waiting. Because time is always moving. Let me see. Do I have anything? Let's see. Thunderbolt rockets. Launcher. Then it plasma's hurt, so nothing necessarily good there. And then, yeah, I have the scrap we can leave. The store, I have a thousand. Food. Uh, oh, we, we picked up some fuel. That's great. Okay. Greetings. Let's see. Ooh, we got a fancy one here. Look at this one. We could buy another person here. <laughs> I'm gonna keep saying that. <laughs> uh, let's sell some stuff, actually. Then we could... There you go. Go into the trading business. Trade, trade, trade. Uh, it's gonna give me 469. Okay, accept. Let's see. Fuel. How much? Whoa, that's a lot. No, no, no. Just give me like, oh man, that's expensive. Hold on a second. Let's say no. I, I want to get another person. So, oh, that's slim pickings. I get one person's one choice. A Hulk and a Crusher, a warrior. Man. Uh, what about this? What the hell? What's face? A diva. <laughs> yes, definitely diva. Shield master. Oh man, shield, does that mean I get a bonus shields? 1482. Trade. No, I can't get rid of anything else. Okay, my drone's good. Let's see if food is decent. Let's go and grab some more though. Let's just grab it. There you go. Some oh, they're cheap. Let's grab some more. Something cheap. Let's see, rockets, rockets, rockets. Yes. Rockets, rockets, rockets. Yes. Let me see. Prometheus rocket launcher. Damn, that sounds sick. But nothing's gonna beat what I currently have, right? I mean, this is, I, got, I found the best thing in the game. You see, shockwave EMP rockets, uh, more of these. These. Well, I haven't used one yet, actually. Let's go ahead pick up some more, though. All of them, and then the fuel that I wanted to pick up. So let's go lower that a lot here. Yes. Let me see. Shipyard. I can buy another power. How much does that cost me? Sixteen thirty-one. Insufficient funds. Hmm. 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 Damn, alright. Alright, fine. You got me. Crowd chamber teleporter? I'm good. I don't want to send my dudes over there. I'm not I'm not in that kind of shape right now. Uh repairs. I want you to dump the rest of the repairs. We can keep this keep this party going the rest of the night. Max it out. 
306. I can afford it. Look at that. Let's see. Now to our next story mission. Okay, who are you? Get the hell out of here. Oh, it's Popo. Oh, it's Popo. Okay, Popo is... Let's see. He's got a lot of shields. Uh, we have a lot of rockets. I'm just going to disable that. Put this online. We have IO cluster rockets. Oh, what is this? Let's ignore shields. That's what we need. Crew damage 30. There's a lot of good yeses in there. Let's go ahead and take that. And we'll just fire. Woo, I like this. I like this a lot. Look at that. We'll target that area there. Um, let me see. Plasma, and then, yep. Okay, we'll just fire on the old, um, cockpit there. Is he? Oh, wait, is he already? He's leaving? Oh, he's evasion. Okay, he's baiting. I don't feel like I got any action out of that, um, out of our hit. He's messing me up. What's up, guys? Okay, hold on a sec. What's going on? What's going on with this? Get the thing fired on. What's happening? Rockets, rockets. Okay, we got a lot of misses there. I'm not, I'm not sure I'm liking that. Let's see. That's a really, really slow reload time, too. Speed fire rockets. Okay, that will not be a long load time. Keeping that cockpit in check. Oh, there we go. Destroy his bucket. Awesome. So he's done. He's done. We got a lot of stuff. Foo. We get some missiles. We get all this. Excellent. We also almost died like a lot. <laughs> oh, what is this? Wait. Is this for reals? We're going right into this. I'm in so much pain right now. Okay. Oh, Mastiff, right? Mastiff, Cluster. It's gotta be the Mastiff, right? Okay, shoot like uh, that part. Come on, guys, we gotta get this. This is bad, this is bad news. They're attacking the shield room, of course. Please don't miss with the rockets. I didn't even see that one where it went. Oh, come on, fire, 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 fire. Just hit him. Good. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Almost lost him. Almost lost him. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, this is brutal. We're out. We're out. We got to leave. Um, Let's go back to the store. Ooh, baby. Okay. This is going to take a long time to fix. <laughs> I'm going to cut this part out. Oh, all right. So it, it pains me. It pains me how long it takes to repair stuff. Oh, you know what? Oh, God damn. You know, what? I totally forgot to mention that uh, there is a speed up, speed down button right right here at the top. It does not speed up a lot, though. It's 1.5. So even with that, you're still not going to get, um, you know, a lot, a, a, a huge speed increase when it takes three minutes to repair everything. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, mission to go to the Popo. What a name. We have not finished that yet. Uh, we escaped from that. Let's go to the... I apologize. Keep pulling up the damn menus. Bad habits. Let me see. God, where do I go from here? Let's go back. <laughs> let's go back. See if we can just surprise him. Here you go. We, we're, we're back. We're repaired. Everything's ready to go. Uh, we can up our accuracy. This time we're going to use all of our everything if we can. The stealth is hard to use because the automatic fire that keeps screwing us there. Even though, you know, it's, well, it's me. It's, I'm screwing me. But the automatic fire is, uh, it keeps on disabling that. Um, however, I was not using my drone. That's right. Uh, there's one more thing. Uh, so, oh, how do I use that drone? I guess I'm going to move you over there. I forgot about that part. Damn. All right. So that's, he's going to get over there. Battle's now officially starting. Okay, he cloaked right away. That rocket's gonna go nowhere. Okay, deploy that. What is that beeping? Is Fred actually doing anything in there? Oh, I guess he doesn't have to be there. Oh, God. 
Where's the rapid fire? Get in there. There we go. It's so easy now. It was so easy now. We came back. We polished everything up. Look at all these rewards. Holy crap. I'm so glad we came back. Also, by the way, super cool that we were able to come back and continue where we left off. We escaped and went back. It didn't like reset the mission or anything. Oh, you've got a rescue pod containing slaves inside. You find an old friend. Hey, Ronnie. What's up, good buddy? What's happening? Oh, wow. You look like shit, Ronnie. God damn. Wow. I have pledged allegiance to the queen. I will serve her until death. Hail. Oh, the children of the Trigon will avenge me. Oh, okay. He's on our side, though. Okay. I love to serve the queen. What are you talking about, Ronnie? Are you nuts? Let me pour you a glass of capacitor fluid. You you send distraught Ronnie to your cabin, just like Popo. Oh, he's like a Borg then, yeah. All right, here we got Ronnie, the warrior, another warrior. Blasting charge. By the way, my name is Maria, uh, or Mariah. I don't quite remember which is correct. Okay. I want to uplink a trillion views. A trillion views is we'll all this later, yep. Okay. Ah, oh, whoops, I accidentally did that. Oh, okay, we're gonna stop right here. I feel, you know, I feel like, uh, is it gonna save? Oh, Jesus, better save. Main menu, you sure you wanna put, yes, yeah, it's gonna save, it's gonna save, damn it. We're gonna stop right there because the episode's going way too long. Uh, I am enjoying the game, though. It is intense. Uh, there are lots of fights. The, the, the matches are very long. Um, or they could be extremely short. In our case, you know, we're just really good, so, you know, we just, you know, Keep it going all night until one o'clock in the morning. Ah, <sighs> but hey, Trigon. I saw that it had a lot of like mixed reviews, but uh, you know, in my opinion, they are both warranted because sometimes the game is pretty painful, like painfully unbalanced. Uh, but at the same time, that's the same issues that I felt like we encountered when FTL first came out, uh, and it turned out the game was just hard, and you just had to get good at it. Nobody go. Oh, I can't beat the rebel, the rebel uh, boss. Can't beat the rebel boss. It's too OP. And then we figured out how to do it. And so I feel like this might be a situation like that. It could be. I don't know. Uh, I can tell you this. I'm enjoying it. And it's available for $19.99 on Steam. Um, but that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Mike PAK Phony. I will see you guys later. Goodbye.